let's travel to Theatine Church in Munich, Germany. Open hours are from 6 a.m. to 7 p.m. You cannot visit during the Mass. Sundays and public holidays are closed. Entry fee is free. The nearest station is Uban Odiansplitz Station. Theatine Church is a church with a distinctive yellow appearance. You can reach it in about 5 minutes, on foot from Marienplatz, the center of Munich. On the left is Feldherm Hill. It was built between 1841 and 1844. The mausoleum houses the statues of Johann Sirklaes, Count Tilly, and Karl Philipp von Reed. Let's go inside. It is a beautiful church with a pure white interior, unlike the exterior. It depends on the timing, but if you are lucky, you can observe while listening to the sound of the pipe organ. Prince Ferdinand Maria and her empress, who had been underprivileged for a long time, decided to build the church, and donate to Theatine Church, in appreciation of the birth of the long-awaited Prince Max Emmanuel. The basic design of the church, which is a cross-shaped flat building, with a magnificent fornix and tower boasting a height of 71 meters, was created by the Italian architect Agostino Vallelli. Construction began in 1663, and was completed six years later. Around 1770, the late Rococo front facade was also completed. The catacombs are home to the Elections Cemetery, which also houses the large sarcophagus of King Max II, and his queen. The interior is decorated with white plaster. Is it from the origin of the building? There are many angels. This church isn't often featured in guidebooks, but it's worth a look. Before Christmas, stop by when traveling from Marienplitz to Wittelsbacher Square. This is a high altarpiece by Gaspard de Clare. There are many paintings in European churches, and you can find out the historical background by examining the meaning of each one. However, it is a pity that I cannot find out because there are many paintings for which information is not available.